Which player are you? Nizze. Okay. The Protoss. So let's take a first person look. Alright. So you're platinum. And it seems like you're doing like a team practice type of thing, which is pretty cool. Okay, so. Make a pylon, make a probe, then make another probe, and then make a pylon. You make a pylon on 14, okay? That one's simple. And don't make it here. This this doesn't really cover your mineral line or your nexus or the rank. Just make it like right here. You can make it like two hexes on. Why am I on normal fucking speed? Okay. Okay, you don't need the gas that early. That'll actually cut into your probe count as well. Not a big deal though. That doesn't really matter. Yeah, you fucked up two things already. You know which buildings to shoot. This is a. Uh, there's obviously some context here. I think that's arguable for both of you. Okay, so let's see how many probes you miss at home while you're. Okay, good. Now build another probe. Yep. Okay. You didn't check his gas. You went all the way up there, you flew all the way out, and you didn't even look inside. Why are there two probes? Your probe still rallied, and you lost the probe on the other side. Okay, I mean, like, there are no tips here besides don't do that. Also, you should be prioritizing getting the cyber core over fucking up your micro. Now get a probe. I don't just probe, literally probes and pylons. That's all I can say right now. Yes, he did have a barracks. Astute observation. But you don't know if he had a double gas and is going reactor cyclone and is going to fucking kill you. Alright? he do You don't know that. Because your probe didn't see shit. Yes, good supply block. Make sure you get that chrono boost so you can not build that adept even faster. Probes and pylon. Don't you dare make a stargate on me. Yes, phoenix adept is good, but only if you can micro it all. You're going to build a stargate, aren't you? Oh, he fucked up. Okay, 250 get. Build something. At this point, you want to build something. Yeah, 300 get. What are you, saving it for uh, an oil embargo? I don't... Uh, a Twilight Council. So, there were... There were, like, three choices... There. There's a Stargate, Robo, and Twilight Council. And when it comes to like a standard solid build, you made the third best choice. Don't try too hard here. The worst thing you can do is micro too hard. Because you're not... You're not building any probes. You're not building any tech. You have 450 minerals, only one gateway on the way. You're chrono boosting the gateway that isn't building anything. And you're going Twilight Council. The worst thing you can do right now is micro. Uh, you got that uh, marine. That's going to change everything. So, you killed two SCVs 
in the time it took you to kill those two SCVs, you could have built three to four probes. Let's just, let's just talk about that for a second. So, killing those two SCVs cost you four probes, so it's a net loss. What are you doing with your gas? At least get a robo, a dark shrine, so even a Templar archives, fuck it. This is like buying a private jet and only using it to drive down the runway and look cool, all right? You may think you look fancy, but you're not going anywhere, all right? You don't even have a pilot's license. Who gave you a jet? How can you afford that? I'm not entirely sure. It must have been an inheritance because you obviously didn't earn it. You got 700 gas. Robo, you just, okay. Robo, just in every matchup, pretty much, before five minutes. At this point, just every matchup, it doesn't even matter. Because sentries suck. I mean, they look good, they feel good, but they suck. All right, so... In that way, they have a lot in common with your mother. More adepts. So he has a bunker, he has a tank. Let's make some more adepts. Let's do that. It, seem, it seems like you've seen what he's doing, but you're just... It, it doesn't matter. At this point, why even scout at all? You're just going to make adepts either way. We both know it. There's the Templar Archives. And let's 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 real talk right now. You had no plan. There was no but based on what I see right now, past about the four minute mark, even before you built the Twilight Council, you had no plan. So right now, get your notebook out, get your number two pencil, get your Ticonderoga classic yellow pencil out, because here's what you're gonna do. Here's what you're gonna do. You're going to make the gate expand, and you're going to do it right with the things I said before. After that, you're going to get a robotics facility after your Mothership Corn Adept. Just get a robo. Why not? It's the safest option. Okay. So, from there, three gate robo expand. From that point, you're going to be looking to go into Colossi and Blink Stalkers. Now, you don't, if they're attacking early, you don't skimp on the Adepts. You don't skimp on anything. But Colossi Blink Stalker, because I see right now what's happening is you made a bunch of adepts. You made it that far. Welcome to Platinum. But there's no plan. A Templar Archives was a reaction to the fact you had 800 gas and no plan. All right? You don't have very much foresight. You, okay, your father drove a Land Rover. You drive a Mercedes. Your son will drive a Land Rover, and his son will be riding a camel. Because you have no plan. You have no longevity. You have no plan for expansion. No tech. You're just freestyling it. No more freestyle. And don't be like, I got a Templar Archives. I've got my tech. Templar Archives. 
You can't even micro one adept, all right? You think you could cast storms on Tom? I'd be impressed. Where's the, there's not even a robo yet. All right. This is like having a steak dinner minus the steak. There's you don't have Okay, there you go. Only 4 minutes late. Okay, that's better than usual. Thank you. Bartholom 009 for that sum. Even a separate hotkey for the Templar. Good foresight. But now you have no scouting. The scouting before was useless. Now is when you should be scouting. There should be an observer, an adept, pylons. You're blind. And the map is dark and full of terrors. And Terrence. Even worse. Terror, terrorizing terror terrors, terror and terrors, just in general. Okay, that didn't work as well as I hoped it would. But this is the time in the game when you have three bases, when you're going up to your splash damage and your upgrades. This is when you need to have eyes on the map, not, not at the beginning of the game, scouting with one adept and banking up 700 minerals. That doesn't fucking matter. Now is when it matters, and you're blind. All right. He could just stim up right now, kill all your Templar, and you'd have no fucking idea. Okay? Or he could stim into your third base, kill all your adepts, and then your Templar will be hang holding their dicks at your natural. You have no idea. But, but... While, while we're on the subject of high Templar, why didn't the Immortal get high? Because weed is a gateway drug. Those sensor towers. I love those sensor towers, by the way. Also, you're building units. You got that on him. I love the cannons. Upgrades. Look, your forges are right there. Build some. Yay. You did it. Oh, but you were blind. And now you're losing all your probes. Here comes a drop at the nap. I don't think he's that high level, but. Oh my god. That warping. Ugh. Good thing, good thing every single one of your 25 adepts came back to deal with that marine drop. That seems like a proportional response. You got an observer. You got there. Now imagine if you had your robo four minutes earlier. Then the observer would actually be there at a useful time. You're lucky he's worse than you. Which is a, a, quite an accomplishment. Okay? But he's worse than you. He didn't attack. He sent out one drop. He's doing the same thing. He's blind. He doesn't see shit. And he's sending out like one drop because he, he read in his Prima strategy guide. That's a good idea. But neither of you are uh, actively pressuring. And you're not using the select all army hotkey. You've got hotkeys for everything relevant. That's actually good. That's good. I gotta give you that. How many probes? You made a bunch of probes. You don't have a problem. Okay. Now you just need to not be blind. Warp Prism? Okay. Immortal's okay. Warp Prism would be better. You 
tried way too hard there. He's making the same mistake that many players make. The tear. He's uh, trying to micro his micro instead of his max. And the upgrades are on point. Your macro isn't bad. All right. I don't don't. It's not good, but it, it's kind of like you, you're going in the right direction. Yeah, very slowly, but it's the right direction. That lag storm. We're gonna we're gonna pause until the lag storm passes. Well, we learned that going up that ramp is a bad idea. Oh my god, and the storms? So this is a classic example of the person with more shit winning. You made more probes, more pylons. And you win, because you made more shit than him. But he does have the collector's edition Thor, so that he's the real winner here. You need direction, all right? We've depleted a mineral field. You need a plan. If you have a blueprint, I'm confident that you can develop the competence to follow it. All right, so Robo into Twilight. Robo into Twilight. That way you can actually have vision and at some point you can actually do something I like to call harassing your opponent. Uh, let's not let's not get ahead of ourselves. But it wasn't too bad. Oh yeah, how many Bugattis we got in the chat right now? Remember, you can sub for $25 a month so that way uh, you get your very own Bugatti and the satisfaction of giving me even more money.